Hello, this is Kyra, and in the last video, I forced myself to use the standard Minecraft texture pack in order to build the foundation of this house. Let me give you a nice 360 of what I've done so far. Alright. Today we're going to be decorating the house and finishing it up. And this is going to be where our staircase is going to come up. Since I don't plan my builds out beforehand, I'm constantly changing things, redoing stuff, uh, going back on ideas I just had because, yeah, because it's not all planned, so I don't always know exactly what I'm going to do. But I think that looks good. I think that's okay. And I'm thinking down here, let's add in our windows. All right. We're probably going to put a kitchen here, but let's go into our little sunroom here. A nice little place for us to sit while the sun comes in. And let's grab some flowers. What kind of flowers would look good? Um, I think that looks good. There we go. All right, that's our little sunroom, and let's go into our little outdoor area. So, we'll figure something out later, but for now, let's leave that how it is. We're going to go inside and figure out the bedrooms. So, I'm thinking this is a very big room. So, this is a room that's going to be for two kids. I'm going to put in here... This is going to be a bathroom, and then this is going to be a small bedroom for one kid. And then, of course, this is the master bedroom. Alright, so for two, I'm thinking a bunk bed. I always like a bunk bed. I'm going to do one right... Let's just clear our inventory, grab a bookshelf, we're going to grab the trapdoor, sorry, pink bed, or a white bed, we'll see which one looks best, uh, a ladder, alright, and I think I was, it was a good idea for me to pick that white bed because that looks a lot better. Let's see, a little chest here for them. There's our bunk bed, and then right here I'm going to put, or, yeah, right here, a little bookshelf. And a little desk here for one kid. There's our little shelf. On that shelf, let's grab a flower pot. A flower. What kind of flower do they want? Let's do purple. Not purple. I changed my mind about the purple. Let's do... You know what? Let's do a cherry sapling. And what else can go on a shelf? A little light. I think that looks good. And then what else can we do but add a little painting here? Right above the door. There we go. That looks nice. That's our two kids room. And then let's do here like a little baby's room. 
Oh, and you can do that in there. Yeah, that looks great. That's perfect. What kind of things go in a baby's room? I'm thinking... Okay, the roof does not need to be that high. That looks good. For now... Let's place these stairs here upside down. That's nice, that's perfect. And a nice painting, not there, not there. Hmm. This is the part where I really wish I had my texture pack because it has the prettiest paintings. But I think that looks nice. And then right here... Something else can go there. I'll figure something out eventually. Down here is gonna be... Yeah, just like a little storage area. There, that looks nice. That's our storage. And out here on this little garden... Let's do a little chair here. And actually, I'm going to take these flower pots off. If you think they look good, you can leave them on, but I think they look kind of ugly. Bathroom. I think that for the bathroom, we should have... Where on earth are they? I'll just search here. A banner. Like, curtains on the windows, maybe? Because not everybody likes to be watched while they're pooping. Let's do white curtains. A pink toilet. Oh, I can't find any blocks that I need. I need this. A cauldron. So that's the toilet, that's the sink. And I need like a little lever and a tripwire hook. And I need a bucket of water for here, there. Uh, I can't really find a place for the lever, but I think that's good. Let's grab some dye here. Because I've noticed that the blue water does not look very blue. There we go. I think that looks a little better. It looks more blue. Maybe a painting and a... I don't know why I grabbed a honey bottle. That was an accident. And a sapling in here. And here, like a little shelf. That 
that's nice all right so that's all of our All right, and here's another area for people to work on stuff. Let's put there a map, maybe. Oh, there we go. They have the map on there. They're both working on the map. Hey, that's our house. Looks pretty nice. Oops. There, I'm going to put theirs like upside down. So, oops looks kind of different and that's what they're working on and then let's do a little ah can't figure out anything else uh that looks good that looks good that would look good right here okay there we go Downstairs kitchen. Let's just go right ahead. Uh, put that there. Let's take care of that. Start making our table. And let's see if they have a pressure plate for the cherry. Yeah. Let's grab this, stairs, slabs, that's annoying that I keep placing that there. Okay, let's just go back to where it was there. One, two. All right, that looks good. That's our table. There we go, that's good. And we have... What's for dinner tonight? I'm thinking... Uh, where's the cooked food? Let's do steak for dinner tonight. That's good. All right, now to do our kitchen appliances. We're gonna need a sink, a dishwasher, uh, let's do an oven too. big oven and ovens usually have that thing above them that's like where there's like a light in it or something it's just a normal size oven and then there's like some kind of light coming in no, I don't know. I don't know how it works. But I think it looks like that. And then... It's kind of like a weird... There's the oven anyways. Uh... 
do a sink here with some water in it. And then I already know to grab that light blue dye because it looks so much nicer with the water when it's dyed light blue. More countertop. And then over here, let's put... Let's do some ice. Um, and no, we can't really have that right in front of the window. There we go, and let's fix this window here. We're actually not going to have a window right there. We're going to put something else there because, yeah. And right here, it's going to be either that or no window. Let's just put no window for now, and let's go around to our entrance. Did I just do that was weird. No. Maybe I do want to have that there. And then let's put a little hanging lantern right here. No, not there. Uh, mm, I don't know. I don't know if the light of the lantern really goes that well with this house, but whatever. Let's go back into... Uh, there we go. And just put another one there. And I think it's all really starting to come together there with our kitchen. I think that's a nice little shelf. We'll put on it a oops that's not at all what I meant to do uh there maybe we'll have the honor countertop there I think that looks nice so we're gonna add some cherry leaves as like little plants because they aren't necessarily plants but they can look like plants then we'll grab some more of these pink petals and just put them absolutely everywhere ah there's not really many more places we can add them but ah that'll just grow back but whatever That, that actually looks very nice. I like that a lot better than before. And then let's go upstairs and fix our... Oops. Okay, we can actually get rid of those ferns then. If they if they want to keep breaking, maybe it's a sign we shouldn't have them there. That's nice. That's great. And let's figure out...
just adding some mini cherry trees here and actually for the fence let's use a, a spruce fence because it kind of looks more like actual like wood like the actual cherry wood and then right here let's grab a moss block and a there we go Yeah, because these won't grow here, right? Yeah, those won't. They can't really grow up under. Just looks more like kind of like bushes now because they can't get any taller right there. All right. Let's grab our stairs here and see what we can do. Yeah, that looks really good. Um. I think that's starting to look really great. Let's see if we can get a chain and see if we can do something special with these frog lights, this pearlescent frog light. Yeah, let's hang those all around on every corner. Alright, I want to test something out. Let's see if we can grab some bone meal and I want to see what this tree looks like completely. Ooh. Uh... Okay, sorry tree. We're going to retry that. I'm going to keep retrying until I get a tree that I like. Um why is the tree like breaking itself? That's weird. Anyways, looks really good. Let's get rid of this stuff here. And let's give a final tour of the house before the sun goes down. So here is our nice little entrance with a small farm there. We come inside, we have our kitchen. We have a little sink and dishwasher area. We have our oven and our little vent that goes above the oven. We have our freezer and what the heck. I put it as ice. I guess the ice melted because of that lantern. Anyways, there's some ice. We have our dinner table with steak for everybody for dinner and a little shelf with a potted plant on it. And here we have a beautiful sunroom. We can sit in our bench as the sun comes in, all these glass windows, and just enjoy the view we could read a little book whatever we want honestly if we go upstairs we have a bedroom for two older kids they have a nice bunk bed a nice desk area a bookshelf with all their favorite books a dresser with all their clothes and yeah that's pretty much all we have for this room we have another area where they can draw or read or work on something out here we have a bathroom, a nice pink toilet, a nice pink sink, and a little shelf with a potted plant and a painting on it. And in here we have a little baby's crib. You have to kind of go up to see it, but a little baby can go in there. And then we have an outdoor seating area, just like a little deck, a little balcony, if you will. In here, and you'd get there from out here too, we have the master bedroom. We have nice storage down here and then upstairs a little loft area we have two beds to sleep in for the mom and the dad 
let's go back outside onto the balcony and let's just give a good 360 of the house. As the sun goes down, you can see how the frog lights really light up the house. If you missed the first video, you should probably go back and watch it and it, I give a complete in-depth video on how I built the structure of the house. This was pretty much just a decoration video. But yeah, those lights really light that up beautifully. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a wonderful day and stay tuned for more videos. I'm at 29 subscribers right now and I would love to see it become an even 30. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!